Hello, Marco. So I have decided to take my wife's vehicle to town because my truck has got the trailer on it. Now, the time I sat down in this vehicle, I was like, oh my gosh, there is a lot of stuff in here. And I'm nosy. So I'm going to go through it because I want to know if any other woman's vehicle has this much crap in it. Okay, so the first thing I noticed, energy drinks, okay? I mean, there's like, I think six or seven right here. Floorboard, cup holders, and they're all bone dry, okay? Uh, I believe my wife has a problem, to tell you the truth. It would probably be much healthier for her to just do methamphetamines at this point, all right? Because that's a lot of caffeine. Just look at all these empty cans and cups. Look, they everywhere. Look, there's an empty Starbucks cup right there. There's a bottle. There's a bottle. Oh, and look, since we ran out of room back there, let's put one right there. Oh, and would you look at that? An old food bag. Hmm, I knew it smelled like food and fart in here. When you go to a gas station, which it's obvious that she's not done in a very long while, she is riding on fumes right now. Her vehicle's on E. But when you pull up at a gas station, you know, you can just, there's a little thing called a trash can, and you just throw that stuff in there. What do we have here? Huh? Sanitizer. Oh, hold on. Oh, look there. There's another sanitizer. You know, because if you sanitize with one, and it don't kill all the germs, because it only kills 99.9%, .9%, you need that other to kill that point one. Let's check out the center console and see what we have in there. Oh, we have a roll of toilet paper, and it's two-ply. You see, after having a child... Uh, my wife's bladder muscles ain't what they used to be. You know what I'm saying? Uh, so sometimes she gets to pee sneezes. Uh, that's when she sneezes and she pees a little bit. You know, it's kind of like a little squirt gun. She'll sneeze and it'll go like that. Uh, she can't help it, you know? It's just, that's what happens to a woman after they have a baby. But I'm glad to see she got some toilet paper in there and it's the good stuff. All right, what else we got? Looks like we have a rolling pharmacy. Look at this. It's like she's got a drug ring. Uh, in her vehicle. Goodness gracious. Ah, I see we have some Pepto-Bismol. So maybe it ain't the pee sneezes. Maybe she's having the poo sneezes. Dear sweet baby Jesus. You think you got enough napkins? God dang. What are you worried about? If a tanker truck ever spills out on the interstate, she's got to clean up. You can just go throw all these napkins out. She'll be good to go. Now that we have investigated the center console, let's see what else we got. She has got three pairs of shoes. There's one pair right there. There's another right there. And then there's another right there. I, I mean, is it just, she just carries different shoes with her so she can be ready for any situation? Yeah. Like, is you just riding down the road and like, hey, you know what? They're running a marathon. Oh, well, I'm glad I got my running shoes. Let me just put those on. Oh, you know what? It's raining. Let me put on my rain boots. We have a chapstick. We have another chapstick. You know, because one chapstick is not good enough. Mm. All right, then we have, wow. We have multiple receipts. This is a McDonald's receipt uh, from four months ago. Uh, I'm just going to go out on a limb here and say she's probably not going to take this back or return it. Uh, so she can probably trash this. But why so many receipts? And last but not least, we have... Uh, oh! I can't show it to you because I'll get in trouble, but she's got a... Um, <clears throat> oh, yeah. And I ain't talking about no lootling, okay? Mm -mm. That sucker put a hole in you right there. Like, I am glad to know uh, that she's got it in here for her protection. Um, so, so I know she's safe. Uh, but for everybody else on the road, y'all stay away from the black kid tell you right. All right. Don't pull out in front of her. Don't do nothing stupid. Okay. For your safety. I ain't saying she'll use it for that. Okay. I'm just saying you better not try to rob her a carjacker because you will have more holes in you than Swiss cheese. I can guarantee you that. That'd be the last thing you'd need to do. You'd be seeing Jesus. So, yeah. Anyways, God bless y'all. I'm going to try to clean this car up. I love you. Have a good one.